Hey guys, Whitney here, and welcome to my first impressions overview of The Sims 4 Romantic Garden Stuff Pack. So, I know it's been a long time, no see from me. I uh, just want to throw this out there really fast. I was sick. I had a cold last week, so that's why there were no videos, because when I'm sick, as I've said before, I really can't talk at all. Like, my voice sounds horrible, and I, I it really hurts to talk. So, um, I am better now, so expect more videos this week and stuff. Um, I am back in school and starting a new class, but I'm going to do my best to have videos up as often as possible. So I want to talk about this pack and like before I actually explore it, just to let you guys know what I am personally thinking. Because I like to be real with you guys. Like I, I really pride myself in the fact that I am completely honest with you guys about how I personally feel about The Sims. Even if I'm not 100% happy with the game, I'm going to tell you guys because that's just who I am. And I feel like you guys deserve the truth, you know? I don't want to sugarcoat things and be like, go buy this if I don't actually like it. Now, I'm not saying I won't like this. I just don't know about it because... I feel like the last, like it's, it, it seems like it's a very romantic kind of pack and I don't care about romance. <laughs> if I'm being honest, like I want, I want families, you know, like I want, I want just, just you know, restaurants. I want that kind of, like there are so many other things I feel like The Sims 4 needs right now besides flowers. And when I first saw this, all I thought was flowers, really flowers, but I'm giving it an you know, a fair chance. I'm going to keep an open mind and, you know, I'm not going to hate on it just because it's not what I expected or necessarily wanted. Maybe I'll be pleasantly surprised. I'm hoping. So just throwing that out there so you guys know how, how I'm personally feeling about it going into it, but I am going to, like I said, explore it first and then I'll give you my final thoughts at the end. So, whisper a wish in the wishing well. Toss a coin in to see if your Sims wish comes true. With a bit of luck, Sims can be granted eternal youth, extravagant riches, or even the love of their life. That's kind of cool. Be careful because you may not always get what you wish for. Um, I'm pretty sure there's a wishing well in the Sims 3 Lucky Palms. Um, so, it's pretty neat that they added a wishing well. I think that's pretty cool and I'm excited to see like what happens if you wish for each thing and all that. So... That does kind of make me excited. Splash in the water fountain, a magnificent garden centerpiece that is also a great spot for your Sims to enjoy each other's company. Feeling playful? Jump in, splash around, and add soap for a bubbly good time. Uh, build a Victorian inspired garden with a variety of stunning flowers, moss covered statues, and ivy wrapped arches. You can create a romantic garden space so lovely your Sims hearts will skip a beat. And dress in modern floral fashion. Romantically inspired mo modern fashion and hairstyles add a touch of fun a floral fun my god I can't read floral fun to your Sims wardrobe. Um so it sounds like, you know, more modern clothing, but it does say floral, which makes sense because this is like I said, when I first saw it, I'm like flowers. This is basically the Sims 4 flowers stuff. So um, I think they were kind of going for like what they did with the Sims 2 mansion and garden stuff. But that was a really good pack, you know, so I'm I'm I'm. I don't know. I don't know if this will live up to that, but we'll see. Um, when I first saw this pack, I thought this is probably more for a builder, <laughs> someone who likes to build gardens, because I personally don't always enjoy building. So I don't know how often I'll use the stuff in this. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead, jump into the clothing and I'll see you guys. then. Okay, so starting off with the female stuff for Create a Sim, let's go ahead and check out like hairstyles and stuff first. I'm pretty sure they got new hairstyles, so we'll have to check here. All right, so it looks like girls get one new hairstyle, which is okay, I guess. <laughs> I mean, you know me, I always, I always want as much as I can get, but I actually really like this hairstyle. It's very wavy, and I just really like that all the layers actually kind of looks like my hairstyle. A little bit only I'm not blonde but it's kind of like what my hair looks like only parted on the opposite side and yeah so I like it I like all the layers and stuff it's nice don't believe we get any new hats but I'll check nope no new um, 
accessories or makeup as well. So, yeah, pretty much nothing. <laughs> the girls get one new hairstyle. Um, but okay, so let's go ahead and see what the clothing is. Maybe we'll have more clothing. I don't know. Okay, one top. <laughs> okay, what the heck? <laughs> what is happening? Okay. Anyways, um, this top is okay. It's not anything super, like, I don't know. It doesn't really stand out to me too much, but, um, it's all right. It looks like, is that a zipper in the back? That's kind of neat. I like the details like that. And then let's check out bottoms. I am still a little bit nasally from my cold, so I apologize if it's like really annoying. All right, so we get this floral skirt. It looks like it has like a little ribbon. Yeah, a little bow right there. I actually really like this skirt. I think this skirt is really pretty. I personally love floral styles of clothing, so I think I'll probably definitely use the skirt a lot anyways. It's really nice. Not 100% sure about the shirt, but... The skirt is pretty cute. All right, so let's move on to full body. Hopefully we get some a good amount of dresses. Three, okay. <laughs> wow, I'm underwhelmed, guys, with the female clothing and, and hair. I don't know. Um, but anyways, so we have this dress here, which is interesting. Ooh, I actually like it in that dark red. I think that's actually really pretty. All right. Um, it's nice. Ooh, I like it in the green, too. It's a nice dress, for sure. Definitely, like, a pretty floral and all of that. It's nice. And then we have this one right here, which kind of looks like a wrap, wrapped dress with a belt. It's pretty cute. A lot of these clothes are on me of spring, which I am so ready for spring, by the way. <laughs> so ready for spring. Um, but yeah, it's a cute dress. I like it. I wish it had, like, some patterns. Um, that could come with it because I feel like this dress would be really gorgeous with a floral pattern on it But that's just my personal opinion Uh, alright, and then we get this one which is like some shorts with a top and a blazer jacket type thing Um, these almost look like clouds Almost looks like a cloudy day on her shirt Um, this doesn't stick out to me too much. It looks more like it belongs in get to work or, or something like that, but I like this jacket, but that, yeah, I mean, it's, it's nice. I like it. It's cool. <laughs> it's cool. At the end of the day, that's my verdict. It's cool. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and see if we have new shoes. We don't. <laughs> what? Okay. I'm very not impressed guys. Like I'm, I know, like, I feel like I should be happy with each new pack that we get and be like, oh, wow, you know, like, I love this and I love that, but I can't just lie, you know, like, I can't pretend that I'm excited about everything, you know, some people might get excited about, about this, but I'm personally like, what are you talking about? Like, we got, you know, yeah, we got a top, um, and <laughs> A skirt, three dresses, one hairstyle. So I am underwhelmed. I'm sorry. I, I am. But let's go ahead and see what they have for the men. Maybe the men will perk me up a little bit. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, so let's go ahead. Whoops. Check out hair. Hopefully men get new hair. Uh, yes, they get this one right here. All right. So I actually really like this hairstyle. I like it. It looks super curly. I like that. I like that a lot. It has like a lot of layers to it and stuff. And I think my sim actually looks good with it. So, <laughs> which I wasn't planning on, but yeah, it's pretty neat. Um, let's see about hats. I doubt it. No, no accessories. Of course, no makeup. All right. So let's go ahead and see. Okay. Okay. What the heck? <laughs> the men get five shirts. <laughs> okay. So let's go ahead and see. Ooh, straight pimping though. That's what it looks like. <laughs> I love that scarf though. Like that is actually look at that like oh my gosh I feel like only a super flashy sim would probably wear this like a really rich sim Would probably wear this with like a little pocket. What do they call that? Pocket hanky? Pocket? Pocket? Something? I don't know. Um So yeah, like I said, I get the I get the feeling of like a, a wealthy sim. I don't know very fashion-forward type sim. Um, 
All right, so then we get this top that looks like it's tucked in, which I appreciate. I like that. And I like the little details here because men's fancy like dress shirts actually do have that in the back. Um, trust me, I went to private school <laughs> where we had to wear uniforms and I went there for about seven years. So yeah, <laughs> that's exactly what the boy shirts look like. Oh, flashbacks. Um, so this is an interesting print. I don't quite under get, understand it. Um, yeah, this is different, guys. <laughs> what the heck? Um, all right. Yeah, I don't know. Like I said, I just get this vibe of like, <laughs> I don't know, like just a rich sim would wear this. Like I make just simple sims that I don't, I don't know. But if I were to have like a rich sim maybe or like a super fashion forward sim, I guess. Um, then we also get this sweater here, which is, all right, I'm not 100% sure about the holes in it. I think they look a little weird, but I don't know. That's just my opinion, but I'm sure I'll still use this. It's, it's pretty nice. I like it. And then we have this, which again, looks like get to work or something. Like it looks like a, kind of like an employee uniform. And again, with that like little, oh, what's that called? Fred has it in Scooby-Doo. What the heck is it called? <gasps> Ascot. That's what it is, an ascot. <laughs> All right, so yeah, this is interesting. Like I said, just looks more like a uniform or something. And I don't know how often I'll use it. Uh, this is probably the most laid back, <laughs> the most simple shirt so far. Um, they does have the scarf and it is like stylish, but it's just like a vest and a t-shirt. And I actually really like this, like it's simple. I'm a simple person. I, d I like simple fashion. Like, I just, I don't know. That's just my personal preference, you know? But I like this shirt a lot. All right. Let's move on to bottoms. So, guys get a pair of shorts and pants. So, let's see. Ooh. Okay, so these match the, the first shirt that we looked at. They're interesting. <laughs> I'm not crazy about patterned shorts. I don't know why. Even even for girls, like I, I'm just not. I don't know, just not my thing. But but they're cool. I'll, I'm sure I'll use them. And then we get these pants <laughs> that are pretty much the same exact colors. Like the recolors are the same as the shorts. But it's nice that I guess we get that much variety. Um, I don't know how often I'll use these pants. Just because they're styled kind of weird. Um, but, but they're neat. Um, all right. No new accessories. No new shoes. So that is it for the men. Um, I'm a little confused. Like, I don't, I don't know. Like, what? I don't know. I just, I could have, I, I just thought that females could have had more hair. Males could have had more hair. They both got one <laughs> hairstyle. Um, men didn't technically get more clothing. It just looks that way because if you think about it, like, well, the girls got three dresses and a shirt and he, and the guys got five shirts. So I guess they still te did technically get more clothing, um, which is fine. Like, I feel like men need just as much attention in the wardrobe department as females, but it's just... A little underwhelming um, I did kind of like uh, I like this shirt um, but yeah I don't know <laughs> we're gonna look at children um, because I'm pretty sure they do get new stuff so that's a plus <laughs> so all right so girls get this hairstyle which I'm guessing is probably the same exact hairstyle that the boys get just spoiler alert I don't know if I'm right but Usually that's what they do. Any short female hairstyle, they usually give it to the boys. So I actually like this though. I think it's really cute. I don't know. It's really pretty. Um, and then there's this, which is a little bow and a ponytail and bangs. And this is just like the cutest, girliest little hairstyle ever. Um, <laughs> and I do, I do like it. I'm probably going to use this a lot on my, on my children. Uh, no new hats, accessories, makeup, or anything like that. Let's go ahead and check out clothing. Oh my gosh, do girls actually get clothing? Okay, so this is definitely going to be in the boys section. This is probably like, the only shirt the boys get. <laughs> I'm just guessing. Um, yeah, definitely probably won't use this. It's just not 
very cute in my opinion I don't know don't hate me um let's go ahead and look at the dresses okay this is so like that is so pretty I love little details like on the sides and the little bow very preppy very this is something that I feel like a paragon's daughter would wear you know um or like a child that was in a paragon's club or something like she would totally wear this um <laughs> I think it's actually really cute. I love that. And I love it in the yellow too. Very spring like. Really cute. Then we have this one. Ooh, okay. This, I love this. Okay, this makes up for everything. <laughs> Not quite. But like, I really love this cardigan with the little details on the sleeves and the little buttons and just a really pretty dress. I really love this. And the recolors are so pretty too. I want spring so bad. So bad. I can't wait. Um, so yeah, this is probably my favorite outfit for kids too. Like this is so pretty and super feminine girly and it's just really cute. Um, no new accessories, right? Yeah. Uh, we have no new shoes either. So there's that. Let's go ahead and make her a boy really fast. I always do this. <laughs> why are you, why are you doing dude? Okay. He looks very angry. Um, so yeah, like I said, he has the hairstyle that the girls had. Called it. Um, no new hats. Accessories, makeup. They get that one shirt that I knew they would. No bottoms, no full body. So there's that, guys. <laughs> Boys still get... <sighs> Crap. <laughs> if I'm being honest, guy. Boys got nothing. Like, what the hell? They get a shirt and a hair and that's it. I don't know, guys. I'm just... Like, do you guys, do you guys agree with me? You don't have to agree with me. And I don't want it to sound like, oh, Whitney's hating on this entire pack, but I'm being real. Like, I'm being honest with you guys. I can't lie to you and say, oh, wow, you know, I'm so happy about this, that I love this, this, and I love everything. I, don't, I just, I can't. That's just not who I am. And I feel like you guys deserve to know who I am and, and who I really am and it's, I'm just an honest person who's not going to sugarcoat things and pretend that I like something that I really don't. Now, if you guys like this stuff, that is great. That is fine. We, you know, we can have different opinions and still get along, you know, coexist. <laughs> you know, that, that doesn't bother me. I just feel like the, the creative sim items were very lack, like very underwhelming, um, like with like one hairstyle and you know just a couple outfits one shirt for child boys <laughs> like it's just kind of sad i don't know um but anyways that's gonna be it for the create a sim portion of this first impressions overview and i'm actually going to put this into two parts so this will be the final um well not the final part but the first part is what i meant to say uh, just because last time I, I did a first impressions overview, you guys, it was, it was like almost 50 minutes long. It was almost an hour long and it was just crazy long. So I'm just going to separate this into two parts. So let me know if you guys like that or not. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end this here. And in the next part, well, part two is going to be the final part, but we will look at all of the build and buy items and check out all the new stuff you can do with like the wishing well and all of that. So and I'll give you guys my final thoughts um, on it. So, yeah, go ahead, give this video a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more videos from me. Let me know in the comments what you think about the creative sim items and if you are as underwhelmed as I was or if you're really happy with them. Like, I like the majority of what we got. I just wish there was more of it in, like, the hairstyles. Like, one? Yeah, I don't know. Uh, so, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end this part here, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.